Okay guys, so it is Wednesday afternoon. It's my second cup of coffee. I was just working today and then I had to film my Chanel 19 video, which is now up on the channel. So if you guys wanted to check that out, that is up. Um, I'm actually need to head back and do more emails and editing in a little bit, but Mark and I are signing some contracts today for our wedding, which is really exciting and sending in some deposits, so that's fun. Um, but I thought I was gonna kick off the vlog yesterday, uh, Tuesday, when I went into the city. What had happened was I got my lashes done and then I had an appointment at Hermes. And if you follow me on Instagram, you saw the little teaser that I did. I went in for ALC, which is a la carte, AKA special order. And basically that's where you design a bag and specify the leather, the color, the stitching, the hardware. And it was just such a crazy experience. It was so much fun and very informative and educational. And my essay, who I have just loved ever since I started working with her last year, um, was just so sweet and so patient and she took out all these bags for me to take a look at the leather, the color, uh, size reference. So it was just super informative and educational. And she called another sales associate to, who I guess has had more experience with a la carte, just uh, double check and take a look at the selections that I made. So I think I'm gonna hold off on the reveal until I get the bag, which could take a couple of months. But um, yeah, I placed a special order and we'll see what happens when it arrives. And I'm going to do a dedicated story time and sit down video on the a la carte experience or special order experience um, on a Thursday video. So stay tuned for that. And I'll talk about like my journey because I know everyone's is different. Uh, I obviously didn't expect to get offered a la carte like this because it hasn't even been a year but I mean I just never know with timing so I I just really love my essay because she was so sweet and so nice and it's always a fun experience when I go into the store um, but yeah uh, I am going to do some work Mark and I are cooking dinner tonight another blue apron recipe again not sponsored we're just trying out different things but now that we have weighed i think we might stop blue apron just because it's getting kind of expensive and with the puppy it's just you know we're just buying a lot of his stuff so um yeah uh okay going to go and do some work now bye tonight's recipe is oregano chicken and fresh tomato pan sauce It's still good. It's not too bad it is. Hmm? That's insane. Hi. We weren't able to vlog today, but Wade is going for another pet visit, so we're late. Let's go.
Marco and I did some grocery shopping. Grocery shopping, we picked up barbecue chicken. And I also grabbed turtle chips again. This is the flame and lime flavor. And the other one was, is this one people told me is like um like the sweet rice cake or something. So I'm gonna try this, I'm excited. Oh, duh, it says right here on the sticker, sweet bean. There's peanut butter in it so Marco cannot have. So I will do a taste test later. Wade is eating his dinner. I'm gonna eat my dinner. Got Mario cold. And bubble tea. Marco is inflating the air mattress because we need to take the TV down and install this. We've been waiting for this. How many months have we been waiting for this? Like four or five? Yeah. Wade is eating his calm. Hi, Wade. So this is injolni flavor. There is like a peanut butter flavor to it. So I can't have it. You cannot. Mm. Also, wedding checklist. Pay the deposit for our venue and our photographer. And it's noisy, so I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, it's quiet again. That definitely does have a peanut butter flavor to it. Hmm. It's a good thing someone told me before I offered it to. <laughs> yeah. Good morning guys, it is Sunday. I meant to film the past, I think, day, two days, but wasn't able to really film much content because yesterday ended up just being a family day and today we are helping Marco's brother and his wife move. So there's gonna be a lot of things happening today, um, but I'll try and film what I can. The fun thing is I actually helped design the space that Marco's brother and his wife are moving into. I helped them figure out furniture for their new spot right now. So I will kind of show you guys how everything comes together. Stay tuned, but we gotta go do a Dunkin' run right now for the fam, so bye. Good morning guys, this is my second cup of coffee. It is Monday, sorry if you hear the saw or jackhammer, I don't know what tool is being used outside, but garage renovations are underway, so that's what's going on there. Wade is being a well-behaved little boy and napping in his playpen. Um, I'm getting some work done. I pushed back my morning and held off on any verbal vlogging because to be honest, I was just like in a cranky mood. Don't know why, I just honestly woke up on the wrong side of the bed and everything was just kind of irking me. So um, I feel much better now that I've been caffeinated. I've 
fed myself. I have gotten a lot of my to-do list done. Um, and right now I'm just kind of working on pricing for some things that I'm listing on my shop account. Um, so there's going to be a couple of things that I'm listing today. And then there are some things that I'm on the fence about selling. So I feel like I might wait a few more days. If you guys don't follow me already, I have a shop account where I list the things that I'm kind of just purging from my closet because I just don't want to hang on to any more things. So um, yeah, I will be just working on some pricing. Things I'm definitely selling is one of the Burberry trenches I have because I just prefer my vintage one more with the oversized fit and my LV agenda. And I think my LV zip pouch thing because my laptop now is just too big for it. Um, so I'm going to be listing those three things I just don't want my shelves to be so packed. And I think I want to reconfigure my office a little bit and close up that shelving. So um, yeah, we're gonna probably do a, an Ikea run once Mark and I have like a little bit more free time. I think we are heading over to his brother and sister-in-law's place tonight to help them build furniture. I'm gonna work on this pricing and then we can get upstairs and I'll show you guys the stuff that I'm thinking of letting go. And I think that's probably gonna be it for today's vlog. So I'm gonna finish up my coffee. I'll see you guys later. Okay, so before we head upstairs, I just wanted to show you guys um, more of the Philips Hue. So we've had the bars for a while, and those are just sitting on top of the bookcase. And then Marco and his brother installed the gradient light strip behind the TV. So you can kind of see it like right there. We had some adhesives that just went on the back of the TV. And if you are going to get it to kind of match up whatever is on the screen, see how like the colors match, you need the sink box. And then the other thing you need is the bridge. What does the bridge do? The bridge is basically what gives all the connections, sends all the connections, essentially. You need the bridge for sure. Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna link all of the stuff down below. We were waiting for the gradient light strip for a while, but it recently came back in stock. I think it's the sink box that has been sold out too, right? Yeah but I'm gonna try and link what I can. Um, but yeah, just wanted to show you guys the Philips thingy-majiggy before we head upstairs. I've got a ton of dust bags over here, but I am selling this Burberry Trench. This is one that I got straight from the store and it's the Waterloo. It's a little bit more of a slim fit, but um, letting this one go because I like my vintage one a lot more. Also selling the smaller Agenda because I like my bigger one more. This one is getting sold. To be honest, I've just been like, I don't want this to be stuffed with bags, especially since I'm not really leaving the house as much as I used to. So uh, letting go of that one. I have these guys that I'm thinking about. Both Chanel's, I still need more time to think about. So yeah, this is the Jumbo. The Devel. I think I'm definitely gonna sell the keep all though because I did mention this in my purge, but not selling because I need to make room for something. Um, I don't have any bags that I'm really eyeing right now because I did do the special order, but that's still a few months away. I just don't want bags sitting for an extended amount of time, you know? Uh, so, and I have the downtime to kind of post and ship everything out so yeah um that is what's going on up here i think i'm going to wrap up the vlog if you guys would like to see what i have for sale i will have my shop account linked down below as well and that's it so thank you so much for watching the vlog i will see you guys next time